one as MK Seri Aman launched a water rocket in a school field during the officiating ceremony of the Mathematics and Science Carnival. The rocket was launched vertically upward, okay, vertically upward from the surface of the field with its velocity given by this one. After a T second from the surface of the field. So we know that here that we are talking about displacement like velocity and displacement. So when we are talking about displacement, we know that when S is equal to zero because it launches from the surface of the field. Right, so and it's going up. So s is equal to zero, at t is equal to zero, s is equal to zero. So this is the velocity where we know that here t is equal to zero, v is equal to zero. Okay, it's because it said that from the surface of the field, the rocket stop momentarily p second. Find the value of p. So we see here stop. So what does it mean by stop? Stop means v is equal to 0, right? It's not moving. So basically, v is equal to 20 minus 10t. When v is equal to 0, so 10t is equal to 20, t is equal to 20 divided by 10, which is 2, sec two seconds. So we can say that at 2 seconds, so find the value of p, p second, so this one, value of p is equal to 2. So, B expressed in term of T, displacement as meter of the rocket in T second. So, here before that, this uh, for this chapter, the most important thing that you need to remember is how to convert. So, displacement, velocity, acceleration. So, we see here, this is the root. So, in order to get A, you must have V. In order to get S, you must have V. So, for example, if the question asks you to get A and S is given, that means you have to calculate V first before you can calculate A. So, we know that going to the right, this one is uh, differentiation. So, this S over dt. So, the, uh, this one is dV over dt. You see here, S to V. So, in this case, it's given v, v, right? So, to get S. So, if you are going another way around, it is integration of V. Integration of V, you can get S. And here, integration of A, you can get V. So, if you can remember this one, then it will be easier. Then it will be easy for you to solve. Uh, this chapter okay so now for v so displacement displacement is s so to find s you see here integration of v integration of v dt why because in term of t okay so we see here v our v is 20 minus 10 t dt so when you integrate 20 you get 20 t when you integrate negative 10 t, so how to integrate? So you just take the constant. So t is actually power of 1, right? So we add the power with 1, we get 2 and then we divide with power. So this one is indefinite integral. What I mean by in indefinite, you see here you don't have from where to where. Usually from A to B, you see here when in the integration chapter you have this, right? So if you don't have this, we call this indefinite where you have to add plus c. So you have 20t minus 10 divided by 2 is 5t square plus c. So this one is your s. But then you cannot just stop like this. You need to know what is your c. So in the question, you say start from the surface. Surface is the reference s is equal to 0 when it starts. So when s is equal, when t is at t is equal to 0, s is equal to 0. So here you just substitute 0 is equal to 20 times 0 is 0. This one is 0. Plus C, so basically C is equal to 0. So here you get S is equal to 20T minus 5T square. So express in term of T, S is equal to 20T minus 5T square. C determine the maximum height in meter of the rocket. So this one you see here. What does it mean by differentiation? So th that means you are doing radian. So this one you see here, 20t minus 5t square. So here we see here, this one, the highest, uh, this one is quadratic graph with t square is negative. So it's something like this, right? So we know that v is the gradient. So when it's going up, 
uh, v is larger than 0 when going down v is smaller than 0 so write the gradient when we are talking about gradient going up is positive going down is negative so there's a point here at the most peak here which is the maximum point v is equal to 0 so when you have larger than 0 before you're coming to smaller than 0 you must pass through 0 first right so you have here for example if you have negative 2 negative 1 you must go you must pass 0 first before you can go to positive or positive to negative you must pass 0 so there is this point okay so same if they say maximum velocity that's mean a is equal to 0 so in this case v is equal to 0 so we calculate in a right just now so just I'm doing we calculate in a when v is equal to 0 so when v is equal to 0 t is equal to 2 right so here t is equal to 2 so we can substitute when t is equal to 2 s is equal to 20 so t here is 2 minus 5 2 square so here we get 40 minus 5 4 40 minus 20 so here we get 20 this one is meter So we can say that the maximum height in meter of the rocket is 20 meter. Second, the time in second when the rocket touches the surface of the field. So what does it mean? Touches the surface. So we know that it started from the surface and then coming back from the surface. So here we can say that displacement is zero. So we start from zero and come back to zero. So we just substitute here 20t minus 5t square is equal to zero. So we can, you see here, you can take out 5t, right? We can factorize. 20t divided by 5t, you get 4. This one you get t is equal to zero. So 5t is equal to 0, t is equal to 0, 4 minus t is equal to 0, t is equal to 4. So this is the condition when s is equal to 0. So this one is when it first start, it start from s is equal to 0 and this one when it come down. So the time when the, when the rocket touches the surface, t is equal to 4. Or we can see that for second.